subscribers Warren Lucifer, Two Bugs and a Back, and Tim Durham were all about time certs. Tim was saying that time certs are what Porsche use themselves to fix stripped threads. So that's a good recommendation. The kit is more comprehensive than the helicoil kit, better quality tools for sure, and that is a time cert. It is a solid piece of steel with threads on the inside and the outside. The time cert kit also comes with this countersink bit that allows the time cert's flange to sit flush with the metal surface. Time to try out these time certs. This kit is very nice. It does cost twice as much as the $32 helicoil kit, but all the tools are present, including a drill bit, and they're all very nice quality. First thing I noticed here is the drill bit is much better at cutting through the aluminum. Then, of course, cleaning up as much of those metal shavings as possible. They are my least favorite part of this whole thing. Now you can see that that hole has been drilled out. There's not really any threads remaining. We're now going to use the countersink bit to countersink a section for the flange to go in. The shop air really was the best way of cleaning that out, even though it pains me to put more metal shavings all over the shop. This is the tap that came with the time cert kit. Works really the same way as the tap that we had for the helicoil kit. And finally, we use this installation tool. We want to check the depth first of all and mark that on the tool. Then I did move over to using engine oil here as my lube. It's recommended to use that on the install tool as well. So here is the time cert going on to the installation tool. And you just keep screwing that in. And eventually it's going to get more difficult that you kind of need the wrench to continue. I was concerned that the top of the flange wasn't going below the level of the engine case, but you do need the wrench to do that final little bit. Then you keep going till it starts feeling easy again, which was right there, or until you get to that line you drew on the installation tool. And that's it. So let's compare the results. That's an original bolt hole in good condition, and it feels pretty good. Here is the time cert. Really feels pretty much the same as the good bolt hole. Slightly rougher, maybe just because it's so new. And then the helicoil was a little weird to get it started, but once it was in there, it did feel good, and it kind of tightened up towards the bottom. That's the helicoil. It really does look like those are actual threads, but that's that coil of wire. And here is the time cert after installation, distinctive with that darker metal color and of course that flange around the edge. All right, decision time. I think from my little experiment here, the time cert is the one I wanna go with. Another thing too, is I'm not messing around with these metal shavings. I'm wrapping this thing up like ET. That metalized duct tape is very handy here. All right, those are the threads that are ripped out at the very top. There's not enough there to work with. So step one is get rid of everything that's in there. That drill bit was much better than the Black & Decker drill bit, whatever magic is in that thing. Now we're lubing up again and doing the countersink tool. It has a flat edge on it, so you kind of know when you got to the end, it'll just stop going any deeper. Then we check the depth on the installation tool. Then we're tapping that hole with the tap that came with the time cert kit. Now final bit of lube to install the time cert itself. And then that last bit of turning till it gives in. And then I just kept going till it went to the line, which is in the instructions to do that. Then unwrapping our patient is done. For any of you who are actually going to do this, those measurements might be helpful. And if you're wondering what happened to the thread that I stripped out, Look at it. It's like its own little helicoil stuck still on the bolt. Now, finally, we can get back to where we were three weeks ago and install this secondary air pipe and all its paraphernalia. 